So today we have a small trial round for the interview where people will be dressing up and they will be showing us how exactly they go for the interview. So if you see any flaws in their speaking style, makeup, dressing, anything, we'll be giving them feedback, we'll be correcting and then we'll be working on the next step. So, it's, so all are getting ready, many people have not come, so let's see how it goes. So few of them are getting ready there in the class. Hi guys. Hi. Getting ready? Yes. Yeah. How are you feeling? Excited? I'm excited. Nervous? <laughs> All the best. How is your eye contact? So everything you have to observe properly. And you start working on those areas. Actually, we did this a lot before. But the problem was, as you know, that you were going and not coming here before interview. So let's see how things go for us. Be confident and assume that it is a real interview. Don't take it lightly. It is a real interview. Correct? What are the basic questions I will ask? I have made 16 basic questions. Just keep in your mind. I will ask you. First, tell me something about yourself. Yeah. Why do you want to join Indigo Airlines? That means you should know information about this particular company. What is your five-year plan? That means where do you see yourself five years from now? That means I will check how futuristic you are. Yeah. Tell me something about your hometown. That means wherever you come from, you have to describe that particular place for at least 30 to 40 seconds. That's it. Yeah. Next one will be, what would you say when you are asked to give a self-introduction? Yes, tarah se post sakte hai. Meaning is the same. Tell me something about you. It's the same thing. But ke ke aap se wo. Okay? Your strength and your weakness. This will be the question I will ask you. Common question ho gaya, koi difficult nahi hai. What are your hobbies? I want you to describe your hobby in a very beautiful way. Very beautiful way. With grammar mistakes, I don't want any grammar mistake. Yeah? What is your worst feedback? This question I add kiya yahan pe. What is your worst feedback? Have you ever got a bad feedback from somebody? Correct? I will ask you this question. Yeah. What is the most difficult situation you have faced? Till now, what is the most difficult situation? You can say embarrassing also. It can be some kind of scary moment also. So what is the most difficult situation? What is your biggest achievement in life? <coughs> he can also use the word called accomplishment. Confuse me. What is your biggest accomplishment in your life? You post sakta hai wapse. Hmm? Why Indigo? Why do you want to join Indigo? The same question is what do you know about our company? So, kuch bhi question aisa aata hai, what do you know about our company? Why Indigo? Why not some other company? Answer ek hi hai uska. About Indigo. Yeah? What do you think about this industry? What industry? Aviation industry. Yes. So, what do you know about this industry? So, we same jo humne last time growing industry, booming industry, fastest growing industry, safe for girls. It gives so many opportunities. Along with that, we also learn about so many cultures and places. Yeah. Do you like being around people? Very important question. Do you like being a people person? Do you like being around people? Yes, of course. I'm a people person. I love to talk to people, communicate with everyone. Yeah. Give an example where you really held your temper. That means you really got angry. And you got a chance to hold your temper. Because this, this industry, you may get angry. So how did you hold your temper? Ek story story. What will you do with your first salary? They may ask you. So I think I discussed kar liya tha. Apart from that, I will ask you a bonus question. That I will not tell you. It is just how you respond to that I want to see. Because you are prepared. But you can come out of How will you handle that particular thing? Yeah? So let's start. And I'm preparing for cabin crew interview with Indigo Airlines. What is that? Hello, my name is Momita Burwa and I'm preparing cabin crew interview for Indigo. Okay, first I'll take a photo. Okay, Momita, could you please introduce yourself? Good morning, thanks for asking. My name is Momita Burwa. I'm 22 years old. I am born and brought up in Siliguri. I have five family members in my family, including me. And currently, I am staying with my parents. In academics, I have completed my schooling from Marcus Sinita English School. 
completed my graduation from Salibri College and right now I am also in master's course from North Bengal University. That's all about me. Okay. So you're doing your master's. Uh, why you want to be a cabin crew? So I want to become a cabin crew because this industry is uh, rapidly growing and in a uh, because this industry is safe for girls mm -hmm. and in coming days it will grow faster, more faster mm -hmm. and I think this industry is safe for girls. Okay. And what do you know about Indigo Airlines? So I want to go with Indigo because Indigo mm -hmm. Airlines is one of the most leading industry mm -hmm. and top choice for the passengers. Mm -hmm. uh, it is also known well known for uh, excellent customer care service. And also whenever I see a girl in your uniform, I feel mm -hmm. more energetic, mm -hmm. powerful and confident. Tell me something about your hobbies. My hobbies, I love doing makeup. In my free time, I, I like doing makeup. I like to try new trendy makeup tricks. Mm -hmm. Also dancing, listening music. I also do workout. Mm -hmm. That's all. Okay. Okay, Nisha Yadav, you're from Siliguri. Yes, sir. Okay, could you please tell me something about you? As you already say my mm -hmm. name, my name is Nisha Yadav. I came from Siliguri Shimande. I live with my family, my mom, dad and two younger siblings. Mm -hmm. I'm a very adventurous person and love traveling to different places. Also, I like to group myself with other people. Mm -hmm. I like to make a new friends and also I'm a very quick learner and believe the learning from my past mm -hmm. and that's all about me. Thank you. Something about your hobby Nisha? My hobbies are dancing, cooking because it's not mm -hmm. only make me happy, it also keep me active. Uh, also, and whenever I pre get a free time, I would like to make a read. Very nice. Why do you want to be a cabin crew? Uh, I want to become a cabin crew because I think I have all the quality that mm -hmm. cabin crew should have. I am a people person. I love to make a new friend. And I think this quality will help me to, uh, mm -hmm. to feel passenger safe and convenient. What are your strengths and weaknesses? Uh, my strength is my family because uh, they are always available whenever I need. I feel blessed to share a, such a beautiful bond with my family. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, weakness is I am too helpful sometimes. Mm -hmm. Due to it, uh, I like whenever I uh, and whenever I help someone, in mm -hmm. feel I feel like. Uh, I get something in a re return. If I don't get it, I feel sad. Mm. So I think this is my weakness. But uh, I will try to overcome it. And I think this will be. Okay, Nisha, that's all from my side. You can. Okay, please be seated. Okay, Pranisha, uh, could you tell me something about you? Good morning, sir. My name is Pranisha Chetri. I am from Lohagati Garden. Mm -hmm. I am 21 years old. I am pursuing my graduation from Siliguri College. Mm -hmm. I live with my family. I have five members in my family. Okay. I'm a self-motivated person. Mm -hmm. I'm a hardworking person. Okay. Tell me something about your hobbies. My hobbies. Mm -hmm. My hobbies is reading books and making paintings. I love to. I love making paintings because it gives me self-satisfaction, mm -hmm. and I love to decorate my house. Why do you want to be a cabin crew? Because uh, I love traveling and exploring new places mm -hmm. and also in my village there is no one who became a cabin crew. Mm -hmm. So I want to be the first girl and to be an inspiration to the other girl. Okay, very nice. And why are you not continuing your education? <laughs> because I don't like studying. You don't like to study? Yes, okay, sir. okay. Okay, Pranisha, that's all from my side. I'll let you know what happens. Okay, Sukhmaya, what is your surname? And I have completed my uh, graduation from Birsa Munda College. Okay. And my hobby is traveling and listening music and also dancing. Okay. What all places have you traveled so far? Uh, actually, I have been in uh, mm -hmm. Banaras, mm -hmm. Delhi, and uh, also Jaipur. Jaipur also very nice. And why do you want to be a cabin crew? Because uh, this job, uh, this job is my mm -hmm. dream job. And I want to become a cabin crew because mm -hmm. I want to be uh, proud of my parents mm -hmm. and also uh, traveling is my passion, I already said. Mm -hmm. And uh, if I got selected, I will travel so many different places and I 
I will see uh, mm-hmm. many different people as well. Mm-hmm. And also I learned so many things from that. Mm-hmm. Uh, my name is Ritu Shah. Mm-hmm. I'm from Bagdogra. Mm-hmm. And uh, I have recently done my graduation with English honors. Mm-hmm. And I have done it from KGTM College, Bagdogra. And I stay in a joint family mm-hmm. which consists of six members. And I like to play different kinds of sports, mm-hmm. especially outdoor games. And also I love listening to music and love to cook food. That's all about myself. Why cabin crew? Uh, actually, I want to be a cabin crew because uh, it's not only about serving the passengers, mm-hmm. but it gives lots of freedom to explore places, mm-hmm. to meet with different kinds of people and learn to uh, different learn about different kinds of culture. Mm-hmm. So I think that uh, no other job can make us grow financially and mentally. And this job is not only, serve, I, as I already said, that this job is not only about serving the passengers, mm-hmm. it teaches professionalism also and it develops our all around personality. Why Indigo? There are other airlines also. Uh, actually, first of all, Indigo is the number one airline mm-hmm. in India and it has low cost carriers. Mm-hmm. And the member of this airline, the employees of this airline are very responsible. Mm-hmm. They do their work in a very responsible way. And most important, they give value to the passengers' time. Mm. And in another hand, there are so many welfare work there that this Indigo airline do. Like uh, children are getting scholarship mm-hmm. for further study, and women are also getting uh, women are becoming financially independent through mm. Indigo airline. And they also take care about our natural environment. Mm. So because of this kindness, I want to join Indigo Airlines. Mm. What is your biggest accomplishment in life? Biggest achievement in life? Biggest achievement? Mm-hmm. Actually, uh, I think that... Check uh, out this one. Check out this one. Check out this one. Check out this one. How do you handle your temperament, your anger, if you get angry? Uh, when I get, when I feel angry, then mm-hmm. that time I, I used to listen to music. Mm-hmm. And uh, that, that makes, makes me relax, makes me feel relaxed. Mm-hmm. Uh, I believe that medicine, uh, music is the best medicine mm-hmm. to uh, release our stress and mm-hmm. anger. Mm-hmm. And also I love to eat chocolates, so that time I uh, eat chocolates and I mm-hmm. listen to music to release my stress and anger. How do you handle rejection? Suppose today you get rejected, so how will you handle that? If I will get rejected today, then uh, of course it feels bad, I will mm-hmm. feel bad. Mm-hmm. But I believe that uh, failure is a part of our life, mm-hmm. so everybody has to go gone through it. Mm-hmm. And uh, sometimes it feels bad, but I have learned in my life that everything is temporary even our life is also temporary mm-hmm. so we just have to hold on and face the rejection with a very positive mind with a very positive attitude and i believe that there are so many uh, people who got success in their life definitely they got so many difficulties they faced so many difficulties in their life mm-hmm. after after that they, they got success okay that's all okay that's all from my side i'll let you know what happened yeah you can sit thank you for if I see the recording, I will pinpoint in detail. But whatever, because they will also not get a chance to you know record your video. So in, what I saw was some body language problems, some even major problems. You have body language problem. You also have body language problems. So two things are very very crucial here. I'll give you a topic and speak for at least two minutes on that, at least minimum. Okay. What is your thoughts on aviation industry? I think everything this day is in the going to get. Mm-hmm. Uh, and there will be a lot of I mean there will be a lot of demand in the future in the average industry. Mm-hmm. So I think uh average industry So can I start it? Okay, you can start, Sigma. Uh, well I'm talking about aviation industry. Aviation industry is a uh, very mm-hmm. uh, uh, you you will get so, so many opportunities. Mm-hmm. And uh, also for girls, it is very. Mm-hmm. Yes, Ritu. 
According to me, uh, mm-hmm. aviation industry is a very uh, is a vast, flexible, dynamic industry which mm-hmm. gives abundant opportunity to the freshers like us. Mm-hmm. And uh, this aviation industry, uh, through aviation industry, we can explore places. Of course, we mm-hmm. can meet with different kinds of people. We can learn something. We can we can improve our personality also. Mm-hmm. And this aviation industry is not only about uh, uh, take care of passengers' need and query, but also we can learn about... What will you do with your first salary? I would like to give my first salary to my parents because till now they have been taking care of me. So I would like to tell them that their little god has grown up now. Mm-hmm. And uh, I, I, I would like to tell them thank you. Okay. So I would like to have a salary for my parents and I would, I would like to buy uh, two smartphones for them mm-hmm. and uh, uh, because they are not using smartphone their entire life and uh, I want to tell them that uh, your little girl is growing and they are now independent financially. Yes, sir. what will you do with your first salary? I will dedicate my first salary to my parents because they are from childhood. I see them working in the tree garden and I feel so bad. And now I want to say that your daughter is now independent and they can, they can, they can. Try to phrase again, okay? When I will get my first salary, I will give my salary to my parents because whatever I am now because of them. So I, I will love to give my to them and say thank you. So, you to you. Okay, simple. I would like to give my first salary to my parents because till now they have been taking care of me and now I want to tell them their little girl has grown up financially also and mentally also. So now they don't need to worry about me. So that's all.